skadoosh and hey everyone thanks for tuning in all my ninjas out there we got a really cool deck today this one's winning 75 percent of the time in gold rank right now um i just entered into gold the other day and i started playing in rank uh today actually earlier on twitch and we went seven for nine won seven matches out of nine pretty redunculous it's having a really, really good success right there right now. Let's take a look at this deck and what it is. A huge shout out to D-Law Dave, who submitted this uh, seven days ago on Reddit. I just came across it today. Pretty, pretty neat. Here's the deck he's running, and it is working well. It takes a little bit of getting used to. Um, I did lose a match or two in the very beginning, but once I understood how the deck worked at that point, we was just win, 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 win. And we just ran right through it. And I'll show you guys some really awesome gameplay and how to use the deck. And you'll even see me progressing, getting better and better with the deck as we go. We are running four Gutter Bones. A uh, great card just to bring back from the graveyard. Also, it's, it's nice. It's a 2-1. It comes out. It may enter the battlefield tap. But that next turn, you're dealing two damage to your opponent. Pretty sweet. And you can sack it and it just keeps coming back. Hired Poisoner. Really cool card because it has a death touch. People don't want to block these kind of creatures. They get damage in. Or you can leave them back as a defender if they got something big, you know. Uh, Vicious Conquistador. This is a really, really good card. I think I underestimated the Vicious Conquistador. Um, whenever it attacks, each opponent loses one life. That's going to trigger off our spot of mayhem down here. We'll get to that in a second. But amazing card. It's got a 1-2. A 1-2 body, and it does the 1 damage. Really good. Two cast downs for removal. Got to have your removal. Three Kite Sail Freebooters. Um, when it enters the battlefield, target opponent reveals their hand. You choose a non-creature, non-land card from it. Exile that card until Kite Sail Freebooter leaves the battlefield. Great card. Slows down a lot of decks. Three Orzov Enforcers. Death Touch. Afterlife 1. It is a 1-2. Another great card. You can use it as a sack uh, for sure. Here's our sack outlet. Priest of Forgotten Gods. A lot of people argued or didn't understand the, the purpose of this card in the beginning. But it does a lot of good. I don't think we really take full advantage of it in the demonstration of... The, the gameplay I'll show you, there might be one or two good examples, but really it's an amazing card. You sacrifice two of the creatures, any number of target players, each lose two life, and sacrifice a creature as well. You add uh, two black mana uh, to your mana pool and draw a card. Very powerful card. Four drill bits, the spectacle. We're almost always able to get this off, especially with Vicious Conquistador. We attack with him, he deals the one damage to the opponent regardless, and you can drill bit the opponent uh, already on turn two. Very good. Um, it's like a Thought Seize, but for three. But target player reveals their hand. You choose a non-land card from it. That player discards that card. If you deal one damage to your opponent, you got the Spectacle Clash. You pay one. Amazing card. really is. Uh, two Midnight Reapers for card draw. Four Plague Crafters, um, so our opponent can sack stuff out, especially like a Carnage Tyrant or something. But this plays really well with the uh, Death Touch and all that. Um, I'm not... Uh, Never mind what I was saying there. There was an example, but I don't think I this in this video. Uh, four Spawn of Mayhems. This is a really heart and soul. Spawn of Mayhems, four drop. But usually we're playing three to get it on the battlefield. Flying and Trample, four, four. At the beginning of your upkeep, Spawn of Mayhem deals one damage to each player. Then if you have ten or less life, put a plus one, plus one counter on Spawn of Mayhem. Because of the Flying and the Trample, this card is so brutal. Very, very powerful. And that we can get it in the play for only three is amazing. Gruesome, I'm going to say Menagerie. You'll never change me. I'll never call it anything else but Menagerie. Gruesome Menagerie is a 5-drop. Choose a creature card with converted mana cost 1, 2, and 3 from your graveyard. Put them onto the battlefield. That is very powerful as well. We have plenty of 1-drops, plenty of 2-drops, and 2, 3-drops. <laughs> so it does work out. Um, the Gruesome Menagerie is very impactful, very powerful. 21 Swamps, this is for best of one. Get out there. Get yourself some wins. Build this deck. I highly recommend it. This is one of the better ones. Again, thank you, D-Law Dave on Reddit, for submitting this deck. Skadoosh! We defeated the Drakes, and we are moving on. Yeah, uh, Senor, if you could take a bow for us, that'd be great. Okay. Listen, Sanchez. All right. That wasn't 15 minutes. That was like five. Gosh. This is not a good idea. This is, well, it's cool we got drill bit, but... If I play another... Ugh, really? is ever, You guys are such lames, bro. 
I'm gonna run my Is It Drake build. It's so cool. Wait till you see it. I've ran it every day the rest of my life. Every day, you should see, I've run it every day. Oh, look at this. We're in trouble. We might as well scoop this one. Plague Crafter coming at you. Uh, senior's laughing. Good, man. I'm glad you're laughing. I'm glad you're laughing. <laughs> senior. It's Senior. Senior. You guys know I don't talk normal. What is wrong with you guys? Why? Are you serious? You guys are cereal sauce right now, huh? Cereal sauce from the Moss Boss. All right, let's go with the Plague Crafter. Terrible play. I don't even care. Oh, that was stupid. We should have swung in first. I, I would have sacrificed Priest of Forgotten Gods, honestly. She, she, senior douche. <laughs> I should have swung in first there. Yeah, Frog, I should have swung first. That was bad. That was bad. That was bad. Let's see what's in that hand, boy. Goodbye. Uh, oh, he's saving whatever that is. Um, <laughs> look, another priest. Let me see what's in your hand. Oh, it's another land! Oh, man. All right, we wasted that one. That's shit poopy. I thought <laughs> he got landed out, man. This dude got landed out. Rough. Rough stuff. Let's see what that card is. I see you drew a card, sir. Another land. Oh, my God. How is he still playing this? If that's a land, I would scoop if I was him. Dude's got everything in lands. Oh, he's got to have a creature here. Uh-oh, things are going to change now. Oh, Bacon Bota. Way to go, mate. I'm on a Bacon Bota again. What a play. Drops off a Saken Gods. Uh, we'll swing in. What do I got? Two drop. All right, we might as well. Uh, just to get more creatures out right now. Get Plague up. Get Priest. Uh, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I was going to sack our Priest. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Learning experience. No, oh, he killed our main... That was our win con. This dude's running like an all-land deck. What's up with him? <laughs> this guy's running an all-land deck. Any, I should probably have dropped Kite Sail Freebooter, because yeah, anything he gets, it's just gonna, yeah. <coughs> Alright. <coughs> Excuse me. Dying here. We got a card, Fungal Plants. Skadoosh, there's Bono Black. Hope you enjoyed, Skidink. Let's play another. All my life I've been searching for something, something never comes, never leads to nothing, nothing satisfies, but I'm getting close, close to the rise. All night long, a dream of the day, and when it comes around and it's taken away, leaves me with the feeling that I feel the most. Feel it come alive when I pay all calls. Dot, 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 Oh, hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Bad Boy Gaming here, Joey Moss, Skidish. Wondering if a black green death touch trample deck would be viable in Arena. Probably. 
Yeah, that would be viable. They do have um, they do have cards that have uh, you can give all your creatures death touch, man. They do have that. They do have. They do. They do. They do. Sam, I am. We'll go with this guy. Drop him first. This guy's running some Orzhov Ur Supper. Ooh, he's going to be running a deck like my Angel deck. Oh, that's cool. That is cool sauce. I think here we are the Moss Boss. We will swing in. Hit him for one. He's not going to double block, is he? Three and two in modern last night. Congrats, man. That's pretty good. He double blocked like a shot. Real bit in it. What's in your hand, boy? Ah. Oh, look at all that. Look at all that. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, excuse me. My birthday is April 3rd and would love nothing more than you to live stream and play. Well, Senior, Senior Applesauce, if that is your name. It's a possibility we could do something like that. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Senior? Shapoopy. <laughs> My birthday is July 25th. Let's get loaded. July 25th. That's a that's a good time. We can do that. We can do that, Jonathan. We can do that. I'm down to do that, my friend. Um, we're gonna have to midnight ripper. Yeah. I just keep applying the pressure. I don't care. He's going to get all these flying creatures. There, oh boy. Ouch. I'm not rich, man. You guys think I'm rich or something? I am poor, man. Just because I make a few investments in Mox Amber doesn't mean I'm rich. Gosh. Golly. Oh, Playcrafter would have been cooler. Oh, wow. Um, he's going to beat us with his flying lifelink crap.
Now we did that so we can block these flyers. That was ma that was the, basically the reason. We can take out two of them. He's not. He's gonna be a little more hesitant to do much. Pestilence Spirit's fun. He does have a card in his hand, which is really sweet sauce. What do you got there, boy? Oh. Oh, boy. We got to win quick, boys and girls. I think we're going to lose this. I should not have attacked with uh, that dude over there. Wow, is he really blocking all that? I'm impressed. <clears throat> I didn't think he was going to do that. Wow, he did not need to do that. Well, maybe for one turn. This is tough. Only flyers are attacking here. We should be. We might be able to wrap this one up. Maybe. He would have to drop a flyer on us. He's blocking it. Down to three. He would have to deal two damage to us. I don't think he can deal two damage to us. But that was in case he dropped an angel there. If he has an angel... Wow! What a good match, baby. What a good match. What a good match. That was a good match. Well-fought victory. Well fought victory. Well fought victory. Rel, well, rel fault victory. That was fun. Skedingles. Thank you. That was a good one. Thank you. Thank you, TD01G. You recognize awesome sauce when you see it. That's all that says to me, my friend. Dirty Sanchez says, Sorry, I'm pretty new to magic, so I'm not understanding why Trample would be better than First Strike when paired with Death Touch. Both of them are amazing, Sanchez. Both are really, really amazing, man. Um, if you can get Death Touch on a First... A First Strike with Death Touch is pretty annoying. <laughs> that's really, that's a really, really annoying. First strike death touch is really annoying. Yeah, usually they're not combined also, but the two of them are just really annoying. Uh, gutter bones. Are we running another control build? No, we're running this again. Okay. Gates? Really, dude? Really, broskies? Might as well empty the hand right now. Swing in with that. We do have Kite Sail Freebooter. He can do some damage to him. 
Guys, we're, we're, we're playing all black, and I dressed in all black for you guys. I even popped my collar for this one. It's pretty gangster, huh? Pretty gangster. Pretty gangster. We are dropping Swampy. He used a spell on us. He's a rascal. You know that? He is a rascal. Hang on for some damage. We'll go kite sailing. Oh my. Oh my gosh. I guess we'll take Karn. That was kind of rough though. Straight, straight up thuggish ruggish. Thank you. Thank you. He's got the pride meta. We are going to swing with you. And with you. Now what you gonna do? And then we got gutter bones here. And the enforcer. The army of ones. We have an army of one damage creatures here. Calamity would be really cool with that, wouldn't it? Calamity with Orzov Enforcer and Hired Poisoner. What a cool deck that would be, huh? That would be really sweet, actually. Yeah, isn't that something? I was just looking at that like, what a cool deck. Maybe we should build around that theory. That's pretty cool. He'll block uh, the Conquistador. That's fine. We want to deal damage to him. That is funny, man. What a good idea. We should probably make a deck like that. Because you're really forcing your opponent's play, you know? Drill bit to lock it up. We're going to take out um, Karn, Sign of Urza here. It almost wraps the game up. Unless he has some big play here. It depends what he just got. He just top decked a Karn. Wow. Now we just gave him stuff to be able to cast that spell for next turn. Oh, we're just getting landed out here. Kind of poopy. Whoops, what are you doing? Hey. Yeah. That was weird how that worked. Five damage, you'll have to take it. Or four damage. What are you going to do when they come for you, Batman? Is he going to take that for real? If he takes all that, we're sacrificing these two. Aww. Shall I let that slide? All right, we probably want to take out... Maybe I should have waited for my end step. We'll take out that. 
I should have waited. Can I cancel now? I can cancel? Cool. Okay, good thing we canceled. Um, we got the damage in, and now I'll do it. We'll target him. Uh, submit. And then these two can flap out. Nice. And then we have a big play next turn. Get gutter bones back. Should be able to have lethal on him now. That was kind of the goal. Okay, there we go. Got him. Wrecked him. Damn near. Killed him. Wrecked him. Damn near. Killed him. Was that four straight wins with this deck? Pretty cool. Shout out to the guy who made it. I'll give him credit in the, uh, the video. Four straight wins with mono black. Pretty cool. And we're in rank. Do, 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 That's game over. Think. Thank you. Thank you. Whoop de whoop de whoop. Four straight. Not bad. Cool deck. Cool deck indeed. He got his treasure tokens. There is that. Gold tier four. Not bad. Moving on up in the world, guys. If you enjoyed this deck, make sure you hit the like button. Helps out a lot. As always, Skadoosh Bags Unite. PLA. Oh.